What's going on guys, it's Valence and I'm back in another video and today I'm going to be helping you guys boost your FPS in Fortnite. So today we're going to be going through different ways you guys can boost your FPS in the game. So it's going to depend on what kind of PC you guys have. So if you guys have like very old PCs, this video will still help you increase your FPS a bit more than before. Make sure you guys use supporter creator code Valence in the item shop and also subscribe and turn on notifications for more videos like this. With that said, let's jump into the video. First, we're gonna go through the settings in Fortnite to help you guys increase your FPS. So if you guys are lagging really hard in the game, you guys have to go to the lowest resolution. So in this case, you guys can see that the lowest is 720p on Fortnite. And then your frame rate limit, you guys should go to 60. And then for your 3D resolution, if you guys are getting around 30 FPS on 720p, if you guys lower the resolution down to 50% right here, you guys are gonna get twice more FPS in your game. So for view distance, you guys should go to near and then lower all your settings right here. This is just the basic settings to help you guys increase your FPS. And make sure you guys don't have VSync on. VSync is gonna cause a delay when you guys play the game and it's gonna cap your FPS. So make sure you guys have that off and make sure you guys have motion blur off as well. And you guys can turn on FPS or you guys could turn it off. And you guys hit apply and we're gonna move on to the next step. So once you guys are on your PC, press on the Windows key and the R button at the same time. And you guys are gonna type in percent, app data, percent, and then hit okay. Once you guys are in here, go to app data, go to local, scroll down until you guys see Fortnite game, open that up, go to saved, and then go right here over to config. So we're gonna go to Windows client, game user settings and before you guys open this copy copy your settings copy this file and paste it onto your desktop next we're gonna be editing this file first before dragging it back in because just in case you guys make any mistakes you guys will have the original file backed up so we're gonna open up this one we're gonna go to edit you're gonna see all this text right here. And and this is where you guys are gonna boost some of your FPS. So for show grass, it's on true. To turn grass off, you guys just need to change it to false. So discrete resolution quality is on three. You guys can change that to zero. For resolutions, this is where you guys can gain a lot more FPS than before. So I'm gonna have a whole bunch of different resolutions in the description below. You guys can also use the stretch resolutions, which will help you gain a competitive advantage on your opponents and also gain some more FPS in the game. So I'm gonna leave the resolutions in the description so you guys can use them. When you guys are replacing your resolution, make sure you guys change it here and also right here. Once you guys finish, just close it and save. Once you guys are finished, drag it back into your folder and click on replace the file in destination. Now you guys can close the file and reopen up Fortnite. So now we're back into the game. You guys are gonna go to settings. You guys are gonna go to this tab and change your colorblind mode to this one. And you guys will get rid of the fog in the game. Click on apply and you guys are good. Now close the game once again. Now we're gonna go over to the windows button. We're gonna go to settings. So we're gonna go to the gaming section. We're gonna turn the game bar off. We're gonna go to game DVR and we're gonna turn all this off. 
Now we're on broadcasting, we're going to turn this off too. Then just go back and go to your folder, click on File Explorer. Then you guys go on this PC and click on Properties. Now go to Advanced System Settings and you guys are going to go to Performance, click on Settings and then click on Custom and turn everything off. Once you guys are finished, just close it and reopen up. Next, you guys just need to hit the Windows button, right click on this section of your screen, and go to Task Manager. So we're gonna go to Details, and we're gonna see Fortnite Client, and you guys need to right click on it, set priority, and put it to high. This is gonna help you guys increase your performance in the game. Now just close it. So now we're gonna move on to the next step, so if you guys are stuttering on your game and also getting texture loading issues, this part is going to help you guys. So in the description, you're going to see Valence Fortnite Texture Fix. You guys just need to download this. So once it's finished downloading, you guys just need to open it up. And this is a section where you guys choose whichever one you guys have. So if you guys have AMD, click on this one. If you have Intel, click on this one. And NVIDIA, you open up this one. So these are update files which will fix your game so so the textures will load properly once you guys open up Fortnite. So if you guys are having those weird issues where the textures just don't load and you guys start glitching through the map, this is going to help you guys. So next is my FPS pack. Just download the file, open up the file, and you guys are going to see different presets. So if you guys so if you guys have really low end PCs, click on the low preset and then install any of these. So you guys can install ultra low and how you guys install it is just copy it and go to the app data folder and just follow the steps from before. So now this is the last step for Nvidia users. So if you guys aren't, so if you guys aren't Nvidia users, you guys can just ignore this step. So just go to Nvidia control panel, click on the last, click on the last one and change it to performance and then click apply. Now you guys just close it and you guys are done make sure you guys hit the subscribe button like this video ring the bell icon and comment some video ideas that you guys want to see in the future thank you guys for watching and i'll see you guys next time peace out Type Raven in the comments below if you guys made it this far in the video.